All right, YouTube, here's the gorilla lift system on a three foot gate on this utility trailer. So the gorilla lift system, it lists that it'll only do a four to six foot gate. So I was wondering if this would work and if we could get it, get it mocked up to work correctly. And in fact, it does. And I'm gonna show you guys how we did that. So first, uh, the instructions say to just lay the channel out and to drill it on your rails and then to adjust the cable on your gate to get your proper tension. That's all fine, but since this is a three foot gate, I didn't want to start drilling holes until we knew if it would work or not. So what I did was I took these screw clamps here and I laid these two channels on my trailer rails and I screw clamped everything down. And then I took the cable and I hooked it to my gate. Uh, they actually give you a little hook not this mount here, but they give you a little S hook that you can hook on your grate to get your proper tension. You can raise it higher to get more tension or lower to get less tension. So like I said, we clamped everything down, we hooked to our gate and we had to adjust it a few times, but we've got it now where it works just fine. So I went ahead and installed it all the way. You can see I've drilled through the trailer channels uh, half inch holes. We stepped them up from eighth inch, quarter inch, and then a half inch. You can see everything is mounted up. Okay, we got the rollers in the back that the cable rides on. Pins just go through those. And then they've got uh, like little cotter pins that go through the end of the pins and double washers on the inside. We oriented everything so our graphics would be on the outside of the trailer. Uh, the customer opted for dust covers on his system. They're fairly inexpensive and I recommend them. It'll keep uh, your springs and hardware inside your channels from corroding. Uh, it really maximizes the life of the system. So yeah, that's what we did. Just clamped everything down, screwed it, bolted it up. Mocked up our cable on our gate, got our proper tension, drilled through our gate, and put our mounting bolt through. And it goes just like that. Washer on the outside, nut and washer uh, on the inside of the cable, outside of the gate. And then another washer nut on the inside to lock everything together. And I'll show you now just how easy this gate is to operate. Now this is just a three foot gate, like I said, but the uh, customer was having a little bit of issue with the weight of it. And it is a pretty stout gate. It's got some pretty heavy steel on it, pretty thick channels. And I was actually surprised how heavy it is. But now, as you can see, I can literally raise and lower this gate with two fingers. I mean, it is, it is smooth as butter. All right, well, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and comment below.